from an insect that deserves the name murder hornet to the deadliest creature on the planet. These insects prove that you don't have to be big to be deadly. But first, meet a deadly scorpion whose venom is literally worth millions of dollars. Number 10. The Deathstalker Scorpion This scorpion has the word death in its name, so it's pretty obvious how deadly this scorpion is. This highly venomous scorpion is found in scrubland habitats from North Africa through the Middle East and Central Asia. A single sting rarely kills a healthy adult, but it can be fatal for children who require massive amounts of antivenom. But that doesn't mean adults can take this scorpion lightly. In 2010, Air Force Staff Sergeant Monique Monroe Harris was stung by one of these scorpions in Kirkuk, Iraq, and medevac to the airbase at Balad and then to Germany. Her blood pressure dropped to near zero multiple times on the flight before she was given antivenom. And because of this harrowing near-death experience, she has been dubbed the Scorpion Queen. The Deathstalker's venom also has the distinction of being the most expensive liquid in the world at $39 million per gallon. That's because it's difficult to collect and you only get a tiny drop per scorpion. In fact, it takes about 2.64 million milkings to get a gallon of venom. The other reason it's so expensive is that the venom has shown promise in treating brain cancer, arthritis, and bone disease. Number 9. The Brazilian Wandering Spider Found in South America and parts of Central America, the Brazilian Wandering Spider is one big spider with an even bigger bite. It's also known as the Banana Spider, since it occasionally turns up in shipments of bananas to other countries. These spiders also frequent houses, cars, shoes, boxes, and other places we like. Brazilian wanderers are nocturnal hunters that hide during the day rather than building a web. They belong to the genus Phonutria, which means murderous in Greek. The Guinness Book of World Records routinely names the Brazilian wandering spider as the world's most venomous, and although they rarely kill humans, their bite is especially toxic and can cause severe burning, sweating, and goosebumps followed by high or low blood pressure, nausea, hypothermia, blurred vision, vertigo, and convulsions. Fortunately, these spiders are huge and can possess a leg span of up to 7 inches. So if one just happens to wander your way, it's pretty much easy to spot them. Number 8. The Fire Ant There are 285 different species of fire ants in the world, all of them not the kind to approach without caution. These tiny little creatures, once disturbed, would sting any intruder repeatedly, often until death. The fire ant sting is quite painful as well, and the white pustules caused by fire ant stings can last for weeks. Their venom would also cause several skin problems, with just some of the effects including bumps, rashes, chest pain, loss of breath, and nausea. The allergic reaction can be treated with oral medication, however the victim will have to undergo treatment if too many toxins were injected. Fire ants usually attack in groups that may consist of hundreds of individuals, overwhelming anyone they choose to attack with numbers and toxic stings. Fire ant venom, although not deadly by itself, can cause severe allergic reactions to those susceptible to them. They consist of a very harmful toxin called solenopsin, which can cause adverse effects on humans if injected in large amounts. These ants are very hardy and are capable of surviving extreme conditions and are generally found under locks, bricks, or rocks. Number 7. The Tsetse Fly Tiny but definitely deadly, the Tsetse Fly makes its way into this list because of the parasite that it delivers into the human body when it bites. This little fly can deliver a parasite that causes sleeping sickness. Sleeping sickness is a disease that can be fatal if left untreated. Symptoms include fevers, headaches, and joint pains. In advanced cases, a victim can suffer from confusion, poor coordination, numbness, and trouble sleeping, hence its name. It takes over a week for sleeping sickness to develop, so you won't know you're suffering from it until you start noticing the symptoms. Fortunately, the Tsetse fly is endemic only to Africa, and there is no known infestation outside the continent. Tsetse flies are considered the deadliest biting insect native to Africa. It is estimated that about half a million people have already lost their lives to the disease that this insect brings. On the upside, it seems that African authorities have the disease pretty much under control, only recording 977 cases back in 2018. Number 6. The Giant Japanese Hornet Although these hornets are localized to Japan and some of the nearby Asian countries, they are bound to scare anyone that sees them. A fully grown giant Japanese hornet can be up to 3 inches in length, bigger than any other species of hornet or bee out there. 
The giant hornet is, without a question, the largest species of hornet in the world. Although they aren't really aggressive, they can get very dangerous when disturbed, and they are extremely territorial, which is unfortunate for honeybees as their territories often overlap one another, making the likelihood of territorial disputes quite likely. Just 20 of these hornets can decimate an entire hive of honeybees. They also pose a problem to humans. Not only do they induce terror due to their immense size, their stings also contain venom similar to that of bees. And if you find yourself highly allergic to this venom, death can come in minutes without proper treatment. But quite unlike bees, these guys can sting you multiple times, and a high concentration of its venom has been known to dissolve human tissue. Every year, up to 40 deaths are attributed to the sting of the Japanese hornet. Number 5. The Botfly the adult botfly looks like your common housefly, so you'll be forgiven to think that it's not all that dangerous. That is partially true. It's not the adults that give other creatures a lot of trouble, but rather their larvae. Botfly larvae are parasites. In other words, they survive on other creatures, feasting on their flesh as the larvae develops. These larvae live just under the skin, and this is where they feed and develop. Any large mammal is an ideal host for these tiny burrowers, and these include humans as well. Female botflies lay their eggs on the host's skin. When the eggs hatch, the tiny larvae will then burrow into the host's skin, living and feeding in the subdermal zones. If left untreated, the larvae will stay under the host's skin for 60 days. All the while, the host feels every single movement the larvae makes. After 60 days, another adult botfly emerges. Botflies can be found across Central and South America, so the chances of getting infected by these parasites are quite high. It's very important to consult a doctor if you find yourself infected, because if left untreated, this tiny larva can deal permanent damage to your skin. Number 4. The Bullet Ant The Bullet Ant is officially the largest ant in the world. But that's not its only claim to fame, which we'll get into in a moment. They're mostly found in the rainforests of Nicaragua and Paraguay, so if you don't live in those parts of the world, consider yourself lucky. Bullet ants are so named not because they are bullet-sized, but rather by their painful sting, which is often likened to being hit by a bullet. Bite victims have reported that after being bitten, they feel a pain so intense that it feels like they've been shot. To further put it into perspective, the sting of a bullet ant is 30 times more painful than that of a wasp or a honeybee. This one-inch ant is also called the 24-hour ant because the pain bite victims feel can last for 24 hours. Like their smaller cousins, bullet ant colonies contain hundreds of members, and they usually make their nests at the bases of large trees. They also release unpleasant odor when they encounter any predator. If that trick doesn't drive predators away, they would never hesitate to attack, overwhelming any creature by sheer number, smothering them with painful stings. And with that, it's now time for today's best pick. Now this animal looks like some giant insect, but the fact is, it isn't. This creature is a giant isopod and is actually a crustacean. They may look menacing, but these creatures are absolutely harmless, which is something I can't say for the next critter on our list. Number 3. The Flea Fleas are primitive, wingless insects that make a living sucking the blood of other animals. They sometimes even parasitize those animals that are distasteful to lice, such as bats. Fleas compensate for their inability to fly with their ability to jump. They can jump as much as 200 times the length of their tiny bodies, the equivalent of a 6-foot-tall human leaping 1,200 feet into the air. A flea bite by itself can cause itching and inflammation, and an infestation can be so severe that the host animal can develop anemia. But it is as a vector of the deadly disease that this tiny insect comes into its own. Fleas transmit all manner of pathogens, including viruses, bacteria, and worms. The diseases these creatures transmit include typhus and, famously, the bubonic plague. This plague wiped out 50 million people and destroyed much of the population of Europe in the 14th century. Fleas also transmit tapeworms and trypanosoma protozoans, which can cause sleeping sickness and Chagas disease. Though the plague is no longer common around the world and can be treated with a course of antibiotics, fleas are responsible for a ghastly skin disease called tungiasis. This disease causes inflammation of the skin, itching, and sores. Number 2. The Indian Red Scorpion there are about 1,500 species of scorpions, of which only a few dozen are venomous. One scorpion, however, could claim to be the deadliest in the world. 
The Indian Red is the most lethal scorpion on Earth. In some parts of the world, up to 40% of stung victims die. This scorpion is a major problem in India, Sri Lanka, and Nepal. For example, because it is frequently found around human habitations where barefooted children play. Scorpions are shy nocturnal arachnids but will sting when threatened. Although less than 3 inches long, the India Red packs a potent venom, which results in severe pain, vomiting, sweating, breathlessness, and alternating high and low blood pressure and heart rate. The venom targets the lungs and heart and can cause death from pulmonary edema. Anti-venom has little effect on the bite, although the blood pressure medication Parazacin has been shown to reduce the mortality rate to less than 4%. Despite this, the Indian Reds are often kept as pets in India. Number 1. The Mosquito More than just the deadliest insect, the mosquito is in fact the most dangerous critter in the entire animal kingdom. Believe it or not, this tiny nuisance kills more than 700,000 people every year. They are vectors for a host of nasty diseases, including malaria, dengue, West Nile, yellow fever, Zika, chikungunya, and lymphatic filariasis. Malaria is by far the biggest killer. In 2017, roughly 435,000 people died of the disease worldwide. That's one person every 30 seconds. Mosquitoes have a special organ, the maxillary palp, which detects carbon monoxide released from our breath and guides them to us, where they consume three times their own weight in blood. Mosquitoes are known to prefer beer drinkers, probably because drinking a beer increases the ethanol content in your sweat. Ethanol turns mosquitoes on. Plus, all booze increases your body temperature, which makes you easier for a mosquito to find. People of greater body mass attract more bugs for the same reason. Mosquitoes also prefer people with O-type blood. Nobody knows exactly why, but the assumption is that O-blood type people smell better, to mosquitoes at least, than everybody else. See you guys next time.